Amen. Uh, if you would be seated, I'm going to share a song that the Lord gave me. Um, it's a song that He gave me in a, in a difficult part of my life when I was having trouble seeing things from His point of view, His perspective, as we know Pastor Andrew's been teaching. And so um, I like this song because it starts out with the cry of my heart, and then the second part of the song is His answer. Sometimes we need to know His answer. We don't stop just at our cry. We got to press on to hear His answer to our problem. Good. 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 Lord, here I. Here comes David. Praise God. Yes. Holy Spirit is here this morning, amen? Uh-huh. God bless you, Jay, man. That was beautiful. All right, so uh, welcome to the Tree Life Church. Uh, if you're new here, uh, we're so glad that you're here. Uh, Thank you. You know, uh, in the back of the seat in front of you, there should be a connect card. And uh, if you fill that out, uh, give it to Linda out at the front desk. 
we'd uh, like to get to know you a little bit. And there's some of us, even me, myself, I, I call those throughout the week. And we want to get you involved in the church. Because, um, you know, it's great that you're here on Sunday, but God is wanting you to do a lot more than just show up on Sunday. Because this is just kind of like the, the huddle, Pastor Andrew said a few weeks ago. Where we get together, we encourage each other, but the real battle is out there, amen? Yeah. Okay. That's where we got to do our work at. So, uh, we got some announcements. Um, we got the blood drive. We're always doing stuff here at the tree to try and help this community. God That's bless. right. Uh, we're doing a blood drive uh, next Sunday, so if you want to sign up for that, there's a sign up out on the, by Linda out the front desk out there. If you want to... Uh, we need donors. We, we only got seven. We need more than seven. We can do better than that. Don't give me eight. Yeah, no, I got eight. I got eight. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And then also, uh, if you want to be on the praise dance, if you want to be a part of that, that's a great new ministry that we're starting. We have a sign up out there as well. We would love anyone who wants to be a part of that. Please sign up for that. Also, uh, if you've been here lately, we, we're raising money for the food pantry. We're doing the food pantry project. Yeah, you need it. I came by yesterday for a little bit, man. They're blessing people all over the place, man. Handing out bags of food to the community. You know, that's what we do. You know, that's what's different about our church is that we're in the mix of things. You know what I mean? Like, we're right on Shadow On. We ain't on some campus hidden away. Right. We, we're out there with homeless people. You know what I mean? Let's be real. That's what we are here, right? We're real. We're relevant. Relational. Yep. I'm, I'm here hanging out. You know what I mean? I'm out there talking to the homeless people. I'm out there helping the drug addicts. You know why? Because I used to be one of them. That's why. Oh, blessing. It's real now. That's, that's real. why. And it don't matter about if you, if you know, you, I don't know where you're at in your life right now. You may have fallen down. You may have had a real rough week, made some bad decisions. You know, it don't matter, though. God's, God's a forgiving God, Amen. not a judging God. That exactly. Okay, I used to go to this church, and I fell down. I, I went away. I fell off. I was drinking real bad. I was so bad, I was in the hospital. But you know who came and seen me? That man right over there. Sure. I hadn't talked to him in years. Yeah. Prayed for me. You know who opened, opened the doors, wide arms, people hugging me. I haven't seen in years. Y'all out there? I love, it. I love it. Yeah, that's right. You know, God made me a little different. You know what I mean? I'm from Seattle. I say, y'all, that's how I do it. I like it. Love it. Woo! So, you know, I didn't know. I didn't ever think, you know, Satan's a liar. You know, he told me I'd never be up here preaching again. But look at look at this. That's right. Look at this. Whoa! Yeah. Hey, Jesus. Hallelujah. God is faithful, man. He is. So... I'm up here, and it ain't about me, but it's about what God is going to do in the young people's life in this church. Yes. We're starting a new group on Tuesdays at 7 o'clock over in the Life Center for the young men. Me and some other gentlemen are going to be leading it here. I'm, I'm obviously I'm pretty excited about it. Um, <laughs> so uh, I do have a scripture, though. I gave Brad. God bless him for helping me out. So it's, people are asking, you know, what's the group about? And it's in Joel, chapter 2. I know it, it's okay if it doesn't go up there. 28. And it says that the Spirit of God will come down on all, on everyone. And old men will have dreams, and young men will have visions. Visions. That's young it. men will prophesy. And you know what? Here I am, on the microphone, ready to prophesy. Woo! You know what? That not that, hey, it's not that we need to pray, that we hope that there's going to be a movement for the young people. It's that the prayer has been answered that there is a young a movement for the young people in this church. It is happening. And it's starting on Tuesday night. It started last week when we went out to lunch afterwards. We had 12 young men wanting to follow Jesus. Pastor Andrew pointed that out. Huh, 12 guys wanting to follow Jesus. That works out pretty well usually. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Works out pretty well. So what I'm saying right now, man, is just if you know any young men, send them our way. If you get involved in a life group, it ain't gotta be mine. I don't get you know, we got stuff Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, every day. God wants you to be involved. This is this is just a scratch in the surface, man. There's so much more for you out there. 
And one way we do that, we honor him is by giving, because we can never outgive God. Amen. I know I can't. Oh my goodness. Nobody can. So the ushers, we you just please pray? Thank you, Jesus, so much for this time, Lord. And that everyone in this building, Lord, feels your Holy Spirit here, God. That's what we're here for. We want more of you, God. I just pray that you just bless every single penny that we give, Lord, because it's all for you, God. We know You know where it needs to go, what we're going to do with it, Lord. We just want to keep walking in your grace. That's it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Wow.